good morning, what is up, what's going on, all that other dumb shit that people say when they open up a YouTube video. Um, so pretty much the agenda for today is we're going on this like big touristy hike here in Honolulu called Diamond Head Mountain. Um, and then, you know, background, if you guys don't know, uh, I'm from Colorado and us Coloradians really like to hike. So this is right up my alley, more my speed compared to a lot of the other things that I've been doing with my family since being here. But uh, yeah, so pretty much Diamond Head was a US military post and it was used for preventing attacks against Honolulu back in the day. And I guess it takes you up along this 300,000 year old crater. And I guess it has just like a bunch of sick views. So I'm gonna try to get some sick angles of this beautiful paradise I now call home. And yeah, man, I, I don't know what this video is gonna consist of besides that, but uh, hopefully it turns out sick. So far, not that bad. It is super hot and it's like a lot of switchbacks coming up, but there is some uneven rock, which is awesome. We're slowly climbing our way up because we started way down there at the dirt lot there. Slowly ascending, making our way downtown. Ooh, spooky. So like I was saying before, this used to be a post for the US military to protect Honolulu. And with that being said, there's lots of these little bunkers down here scattered throughout the hike. And I just kind of crawled in through this little window here. But if you poke your head out, you get this awesome view of the ocean and some of Waikiki down there. Just nothing short of paradise. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. And it looks like a lot of people will come in here and tag up the place, which I mean, what else do you expect? There's also this cool little plane down here. Probably somewhat of a tribute to what this used to be. Damn, this hike is sick. So the sign here says no drones. And I mean, it makes sense because everybody and their mom's probably flying up here. So I guess it turns out that it's a good thing that I don't have one, you know? Although this would be a really good time for one. So, even though I got ditched by my family and I was hoping to get cool pictures up at the peak, at the top, cause like there was like this little helicopter pad and it looked over and it was really cool. It would have made for a sick thumbnail slash Instagram post. But yeah, I got ditched by my family. But even though all that happened, still 10 out of 10 recommend. Beautiful hike, had a lot of fun. It wasn't really that challenging in my opinion. Uh, it was a nice hike, I sweat a bit. I sweat a lot more here down at sea level than I do up in Colorado Springs, which is like, I think 6,000 feet above sea level. But it was still like a pretty, pretty nice hike. It was. Very beautiful, obviously. And um, if you're ever in Honolulu, check it out. So I went home, took a shower. I was a sweaty mess. But now we're on to our next touristy destination. So our second stop of our little touristy trip is Turtle Beach, uh, Lenakea Beach. I don't, I don't know if I'm saying that right, but pretty much uh, there's algae alongside all of these rocks here on the shore. I don't know if you can see it. It's green and slippery, but the turtles come up and surface to eat it. So they pretty much are right in front of you. So hopefully we get to see some of the turtles. So I'm gonna go check all of that out. So I didn't know this prior to coming here, but I guess sea turtles are protected under Hawaiian law. 
and you have to stay a minimum of 10 feet away from them at all times. Dang, I didn't know it was that big of a deal, or like they were that like endangered, or I didn't even know they were endangered at all. <laughs> I just want to give him a fin, noggin, dude. So give me some fin, noggin, dude. So cool. Oh, there's Crush. Where's Squirt? Oh, there's Squirt. So, those were the turtles. Got to hang out with, you know, my best buds, Crush and Squirt. I've seen Squirt since, you know, he was like a, a Squirt. And Crush is like, I don't know, 150 now? Dude's getting old. Unbelievable. I haven't seen them since like Finding Nemo. <laughs> no, but those turtles actually were really sick. I've never been that close to like sea turtles before, so it was really awesome to see them up close. Um, and it's really sad that they're endangered because they're super sick animals. But, anyways, we're walking around these shops and whatnot now. But I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up the video there. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I hope that. You felt like you were there and you got to see the turtles too because they were freaking sick, dude. But uh, anyways, until the next one, peace.